Okay then, first thing we're going to do is open the menu scene, open the script, then we're going to define some variables. So that's going to be var up equals false, and this will be the input for the up, and var down equals false, this is going to be the input for the down. And we're going to have a var current label, which is going to be zero, and this will be the current label that we're cycling through. And we're going to have a var labels, and this is going to be an array of the labels. Then we're going to have a var pointer, and this is just going to be our sprite no node for easier access. So, first thing we want to do, labels equals get node labels dot get children, and this will return an array of all the children of labels, the node that we created. And then we're going to define pointer, so pointer equals uh, get node right. And finally, we're going to define a function. And this is just going to do a set of position of our right func pointer underscore update. And this will be pointer dot set pos, like set global pos to pointer dot get global pos dot x. And we're going to set, sorry, first we're going to have to put it in the vector2. This defines a vector2. Uh, and we're going to get the pos of our current label. So labels bracket current label uh, dot get global pos dot y. And that's done. Now, first thing we want to do is um, pointer or update. Now, if we run that, open the menu, you'll see it's slightly off. If we add four here, it will center it better. So, open that, and that's pretty centered. Looks good. Fantastic. Okay. Uh, then we want to define the updates which I've already done here, uh, you want to just add this code. So the exact same that we had for menu, but in each of these. Um, give me a sec to copy that. Or pause it there. Uh, then you want to define up equals false and down equals false. Uh, so then, now we want to take the input and do what we want to do. So if up has been pressed, we're going to be moving up along the UI, which will mean that we're minusing from the pointer array. So if current label is equal to zero and up has been pressed, then we will be setting the current label to uh, labels.size minus one, because computers count from zero. Else, uh, we just want to decrease current label by one. If down, we want to check if the current label is equal to label dot size minus one. Uh, then we want to set current label to zero. Else, current label can be incremented by one equal with convention over there um and i think that should work except for one crucial thing and that is that we want to first <laughs> zoom out i accidentally closed the script apparently nice job guys uh, we want to update the pointer to fit this position. So just copy this and place it after your if else statement. So even if, no matter what happens in the if, if statement, as long as the down input has been pressed, then the pointer is updated. Run it now. And label. Z. 
Hang on. And run it again. And it works. And that is a simple menu made in Godot. Poker menu. And that is pretty beautiful stuff. Next time we'll be interacting with this menu. Uh, I'm probably going to start from the top down. And I left Steam open this entire time. It didn't go off once. Professionalism. See you next time.